Hey everybody, this is how to make a uh, semi-automatic. Oh. What I pretty much did here, there's a, a bunch of Show you what I mean in a second here. But as, as you can see, it's down in there, in that deep, dark tube. Um, what you want to do is you want to tilt it forward. You want to pull back just about know, an eighth of an inch or something like that. If you have the rubber band on, you just want to let go. So it sticks up there. And then you don't want to aim it down and shoot. You want to aim on a slight up angle. Number one to give you more range. Number two, so two of them don't fire out and make sure it's closed all the way before you put it down because what will happen was it'll be the compression will preload a second one in there and it'll shoot the second one when you try to pull back if I shoot at me a couple times by doing that so I figured out by a trial and error for that one and I did do a couple little simple mods of the power a little bit like when I pull back I put a little bit of water around here like right inside of there because there's a little seal back here that slips a little bit Put a little olive oil inside these uh, threads because the threads are wearing out pretty quick. They're slipping. Just keep the wear minimal. And um, on this one right here, I didn't really. Oh, there's my cat. I didn't really put much on there. I didn't really do anything to that one. That one doesn't really seem to be leaking. It's all on this mechanism back here, at least just a little bit. Um, to test it, what you want to do is you want to remove this. Just the other side. You want to put your hand over it, pull it back. And let me sure your hand has a nice firm seal on it so no air can get out. What you want to do is I'll use my foot here. Pull back. It shouldn't go back very easily. It should go back a little bit, but as you can hear, you should have compression. You should have compression in there. And if it's not uh, hissing out, like back here, you'll be able to hear it, trust me. Um, it should be good. This works is let's see can I get some light on this here. There's a little flip valve in there that makes it work. So, so this was the review of the uh, arcade one um, pump gun, I guess you could say. And usually this is completely clear right here, so you can see how many balls you have in it. But I just didn't like the look of it. So I covered it in this camo duct tape, as you can clearly see. Um, now it's rambling and repeating, so soft room, ma'am, signing out.